This skill is sterile gloving. This is probably one of the most crucial skills you'll ever deal with because anything you do sterile, you have to know how to put sterile gloves on. Okay, the first thing you want to do, and we don't check charts or anything for this particular skill, by the way. First thing you want to do is make sure your table's at waist level, that it's nice and clean and dry, the package you've got has not expired, and that the package you have also doesn't have any openings or looks like it's been wet inside. Okay, so it looks pretty good. So we're going to go ahead and open it up. Now this particular one here is shiny, so that tells me it's waterproof. Some of them are not waterproof. When you open this up, you want to fold back here so it'll stay open and won't keep flipping back and forth on you. And remember, you've only got the one inch margin that you can actually be touching on. And see the little flaps here while I'm running my hand under? That's your one inch margin right, margin right there. Okay. All right, now one of the first things that I see is my right side and my left side. You want to put the dominant hand on first, whichever it might be for you. Keep a couple things in mind. My bare hand can only touch the inside of the glove, and the only thing that touches the outside of the glove is another sterile glove. Okay? So I'm going to reach in with my left hand because I'm a righty, and I'm going to pick up, just pinch it up, and back off of my feel. When I back off, then I want to go ahead and put my hand in Okay, leave the cuffs alone. Don't mess with the cuffs, okay? So that looks pretty good. Doesn't always work that way. Put my hand in the margin again, the one inch margin. I'm gonna pull the glove up and notice here, my outside of my glove is touching outside of glove. And that's the way it should be because if my bare hand touches the outside of the glove, that means I contaminated my glove. And always back off your feel so you're not hovering. Okay, now again, I've. I used this thumb to pull the glove up, but now that I'm getting ready to put it on, that thumb that's already gloved needs to abduct, hitchhike. Okay? The other thing, y'all, sometimes you guys stand like this. I don't have this issue, but some of you that are big breasted, sometimes when you put these on, it creates a problem. Okay? Now pull out. If the glove tears, by the way, don't worry about it. Now heaven forbid, look what happened. Okay? We can fix this, right? All you have to do is take your other glove hand that's sterile and pull down here. Don't touch the cuff, just touch the palm and the fingers. And now I'm ready to go.